I am here for more than 20 years and I love doing what I am doing and I have my clients. What made me really sell it to sell oysters, I used to work for some people, some Chinese people and they end up closing down their business to go back to China. And um, we had one stall operating and um, I decided I don't want to go and work for nobody anymore because I worked for a lot of people and it was really hard. So I said, well, but I work for myself. Sacrifice and I'm still here in the junction over here. Oyster now is more, it is go to the crop time. Crop time. Now you have, when you go with your boat down to the river, you have to jump out and organize yourself with your bucket and your knife and then jump out and dig your oysters and load up and come up. There's plenty of work behind it. It's a dangerous work too. The oyster is a very good um, seafood. It has calcium, iron and zinc. It's good for your brain. The, the farm will also signify is an oyster vendor. Like if you're coming from that end, uh, it's like a traditional thing. You're looking for the flambo to see if you see me here, you know? Oyster, conch, shrimps. Well, the mix, I have a mix. I have single cocktails, double cocktails. I have a, a seafood mix, which I call a bomb. Oyster sauce is like um, different ingredients. You put bandana, garlic, pepper, lime, black pepper, all different, you know? I can't get the whole recipe. <laughs> it's how you tell me you want it, that's how I go to mix it for you. I even have no pepper, I even have veggie with cucumbers, you know? But I want to kind of boost up a little more like doing pineapples and um, like apples and any cocktail from there. But it's not so busy now to come out with all them kind of stuff, you know? Yeah, my number is 289 and get them this call. They, they know the hours that is come like just six after six, you know. That is with right to Monday to Sunday, but in between, I just take a day off. First time trying oysters, you put a little cucumber and some sliced pepper for me. The consistency is, <laughs> it looks really thick, almost slimy, I want to say. And um, I'm gonna try this now. I'm gonna take a nice piece of oyster. Some cucumber. Oh, not so bad. It's like a shrimp cocktail. Getting a little bit of the lime. You know, like typical seafood, but you know, it have a really a nice flavor. I think the pepper has some tamarind in it, boy. And I heard this thing good for your back now, boy, so. And you talk about the aphrodisiac, guys, true? Well, some people take it for reality, you know, but I believe it's a true thing. It come like if you have a plant and you put in soil and manure around it, it will go green and healthy. So plenty of people believe in it and I just go with the flow with them. Oh yeah, it really works. <laughs>